everyone, this is Jay with Busy Being Better. How's everyone doing? Today I'm going to talk about a subject I've had with a young family member, actually. Um, he's thinking about changing, really going after his dream, so to speak, and relocating, doing a whole lot of things. And uh, what I was saying to him that one of the biggest challenges, it's a big challenge, when a person is choosing to pursue their dreams, it's the fear of the unknown. I think that is the hardest thing for a lot of people because in a lot of cases, you, you can't know if you will be successful in your pursuit, nor can you know what your standard of living will ultimately be like if you begin making sacrifices on the road to your dreams. But you can't get to where you're going without leaving where you are, leaving where you are behind. This means sometimes making big decisions uh, you eventually uh, need to leave your job, which this would be very difficult and a hard move uh, to a new era. That 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 would just because you've got to do that. You have to have a lot of support or a lot of money already saved to hold you over while you continue to pursue your dreams. These changes can be so daunting, but they, they are typically necessary in order to follow your dreams. You may need to give up on a hobby that you've been doing or spend less time with your family and friends as you work toward the goal that you're, you're looking to. And you will need to be able to accept that as you strive to accomplish each task, you're going to come in or run into things that unexpected things, of course. So at that point, you really want to reach out and, and seek help from others. See who's available that can help you uh, along the journey because... You won't know if you don't ask, and sometimes that can be be one of the keys to helping you to move forward. So I was telling him to just, you know, as you deal, as you come to each issue, and you will have them, just face it head on. You know, stay true to what you want to do, and actually, it's good to have the plan written out. Write it out. Have step by step as to what you're going to do, how you're going to go about it. And of course, if it's not verbatim, you know, at least there's a guide for you to follow. But don't let anything stop you from pursuing your dreams. Go after it regardless. And uh, whatever alterations you have to make to any degree, that will come along the lines. And all of this is teaching and you will get there as long as you Stay true to it and don't give up. So that's just this tip that I gave to this young man. And uh, he's uh, making some big decisions. And I, I believe he's going to be successful because he's got the drive. And he, he's just going full steam ahead with the enthusiasm and, and confidence. And that's all, of course, so important too. So that's just a tip for any of you that may, because there's a lot of career changes going on with a lot of younger people. I've noticed that, especially since and during COVID, when people were stuck in the homes and realized that, you know, gee, I think I can do better and I'm going to try something new. So give that a shot. Think about it. Let me know if it was in of, of any help to you. But that's my advice. And there's so many other entities, but I just wanted to touch on that particular subject because that's kind of, I think, is the hardest when you're going to leave a job that you've been on. To But it, the, the benefits is overwhelming. 
Thank you so much for listening tonight. I appreciate everyone. And you guys are so beautiful, so great. And just like this young man, he's walking in his power. He's just decided that I've got it, let me use it. And I so appreciate the fact that I hope the advice I gave him will help. But whatever you decide to do in life, know that you got the power. You can do it and walk in it right where you are right now. Peace. Ow.